People are always saying, bluegrass from Chicago. Actually, yes, let me show you. Chicago, the country music capital of the world. In 1946, Bill Monroe grabbed Lester Flatt and Earl Scruggs and brought them up to Chicago to record the very first bluegrass album. There's the world famous Old Town School of Folk Music, a model for folk music schools around the world. You've got John Prine. With an illegal smile. Steve Goodman. City of New Orleans. Jethro Burns. Everybody loves it, except old Bill. John Steerberg. <laughs> Robbie Folks. The grass is really greener. You've even got young musicians like the Sullivan Sisters who you can see perform with us on Black Friday. <laughs> And we have Greg Cahill in the special consensus. Lying up in the park. Isn't it his birthday today? It certainly is, but it still makes me wonder why. 